July is going to be hotter than ever because you get up to $50 off any smartphone at Appalachian Wireless. Two-year agreement required. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Many are gearing up for Independence Day, cookouts, family gatherings, and of course, 4th of July fireworks. While area fire departments have annual displays, a lot of fireworks are shot from residential areas. With that in mind, fire officials are reminding everyone to be safe during the holiday. Pikeville Assistant Fire Chief Robert Lindsay says it's important to know what type of fireworks you're buying and to make sure the vendor is reliable. Any stand that's set up in the city limits, as far as we know of, other than people who may just pull off the side road and sell out the vehicle, have been inspected. They have all the proper paperwork. If the plastic is deteriorated, if you cannot read the labels, um, be a little cautious. He says it's also important to check city ordinances. Just because you can buy a certain type of firework doesn't mean you can shoot them. You can buy up to two inch mortar shells in the state of Kentucky now and discharge them. However, in the city limits, you can't display or put off fireworks that leave the ground, fire a projectile, or explode. The weather is also a factor. It has been extremely dry. We've had a lot of wind. The ground clutter uh, is dry. The leaves, the grass, and everything is susceptible to burning. Something as simple as a sparkler, they burn at 12 to 1400 degrees Fahrenheit. You get done toss it over in the grass and a little bit of wind, it can ignite the grass. For more information or questions, contact the Pikeville Fire Department by the number listed on your screen. Reporting in Pikeville, I'm Shelby Steele for EKB News.